What is going on YouTube, Sharp here, bringing you guys another video. I am back in Atlanta with Linda and Dominic. Uh, oh yeah, real quick. My mom actually sent a late birthday present to Dominic. A little piggy bank that looks like a Brink security truck. So Dominic's gonna grow up wanting to GTA and rob some security trucks. Pretty, pretty cool piggy bank. My piggy bank was a giant Crayola crown. Didn't have no passcode on it. This thing has like a money dispenser and all this stuff, so things are changing in these days. Uh, but we're, me and Linda are about to go and get some Popeyes. We're gonna try this new Popeyes chicken sandwich. I think Justin might meet us there. I'm gonna see if Hammy wants to go as well. And and I don't know what we're gonna do for the rest of the day. Make sure to drop a like on the video, subscribe, and not subscribe. Let's get right into it. So now I'm trying to crawl through this. Wait till he walks over his friends. The caterpillars. Is that your sandal or his? That's his sandal. Can you show me what I'm supposed to be painting? I've just been informed that I've signed up for a painting class. And this is what I'm painting later today. <laughs> hey, you should just jump around and just play. put weed in it. Put weed, like a little weed in it. In the mason jar. <laughs> They'd be like, what is this, sir? You put my own flare on it. Okay, so obviously yesterday we did not end up getting Popeyes. We ended up going to Cheesecake Factory with Justin and Ham. We pulled up to the Popeyes parking lot and this lady came running out of the restaurant and said, we ain't got no more chicken sandwiches. And so we got in the car and drove off. As you guys saw at Cheesecake Factory, uh, Linda signed me up for a painting class of some sort. And we ended up making these. So yeah, that's what we ended up doing. So we gotta get to the bottom of these missing chicken sandwiches. This is a two-star Popeyes. What are the chances they pick up their phone? Oh, hi. Yes. Are you guys carrying those chicken sandwiches you have? They're not gonna answer. Oh. Oh, Tuna just caught a lemon to the face. Where's your caller? Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, I guess you can't call off work. Hey, you're not supposed to tell him when I work there. I guess we gotta roll up and ask why they ain't it. How come y'all ain't answering your phones? Tuna, where's your car? I mean, there is another Popeyes that is on Alpharetta Highway, six point, it's 20 minutes away. Oh my God. Oh, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Tuna, run, tuna, run, that is a lemon. Oh, 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 drunk baby. Where are you going? <laughs> You wanna go? We got people waiting for parking spots? Bro, no way these chicken sandwiches are this good. It's a long run and it's wrapped around the whole store. This shit is wrapped around the fucking building. I seen someone tweet out, they're like, yo, is it, it how come Popeye's chicken sandwiches are sold out across America? Like this shit's like a limited sneaker drop. Unless the people in Popeye's are just bullshitting and saying they're sold out because they're tired of making them. They have the classic and the spicy. If they don't have any chicken sandwiches, we're still gonna have to get some, so. Oh, they're new. Yeah, which you think they've had them for a while? No, them shit's just dropped. Oh, I was I was gonna come out to the midnight release, but I was at Cod Champs. Hey, we camping out. I <laughs> They're locking the restaurant down. They lock me out. <laughs> Six and a half hours later. That had to be one of the worst experiences I've ever had in any restaurant. Literally walk in, the doors are locked. They had a sign up saying that three chicken sandwiches per person. And the whole restaurant was smoky, I guess from them cooking in there. I don't know what was going on. I think we waited for like two and a half hours, two hours to get chicken sandwich. I got to the front of the line. I was ready to just get tenders and get out of there. And Linda was like, I'm getting a chicken sandwich. So... Are you already eating it? Is it good? It's worth it. That shit is not worth it. There was fights about to break out. The, the employees called the cops because some lady was like talking about fighting over some chicken sandwiches. Keep in mind, we've been waiting there for like 30 minutes and she says, we got no more chicken sandwiches. It's gonna be an hour. They're, they're thawing them out out of the back. We had to wait an hour. They thawed them out. We got our chicken sandwich and here we go. Linda got the spicy one. I just got the basic. I got the basic one. You say it's good? 
I can't believe I waited that long. Why? It's not that good. The bun's like stale. What? Let me take a bite of yours. All right, so like I said, I had a classic. Linda had the spicy. Okay, definitely not worth the wait, but I will say their chicken is crispier than the Chick-fil-A sandwich. You know, if there's a Popeyes near you, you should go give it a try. I wouldn't wait in some crazy line for it. Literally the line is because of social media. Everyone in there was talking about how they heard about it on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. They're like, oh, I had to try it. And the people that were talking about having to try it didn't even try it. I think me, the dude behind me, and then the lady in front of us are the only ones who stayed and waited it out. I'll let y'all know how I'm feeling at the end of the sandwich. All right, so we're back. <laughs> Fuck. All right, so we're finally back from Popeyes. Um, after eating my sandwich, I would not say it's better than Chick-fil-A. I would not give it a better rating. The only thing that I would say is better is uh, the crispiness of it, but Chick-fil-A sauce better. The fact that you can get your Chick-fil-A sandwich with cheese just makes it better. I mean, everything's better with cheese. And uh, I felt like Chick-fil-A was more tender and the bun was better, so. I'm team Chick-fil-A on this one. I would give the Popeye sandwich like a 7 out of 10 rating. What about you? I think that Chick-fil-A is definitely, is definitely a lot better. A lot better? Yeah, for sure. And the service is better. If like, if Popeye's had service like Chick-fil-A does. And okay, well take service out of it because... All right, just, it, it goes based on your restaurant. Oh. Like just the actual sandwich and the taste of the sandwich. I'm going with Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A? Yeah. What would you rate the Popeyes one? I think I'm rating it like an eight. Eight. 8.5. Eight tunas out of 10 lunas. Boy, you better <laughs> watch out. Hey, tuna. I don't, I don't get why she doesn't run. Hey, Dominic, Dominic, hey. <laughs> Release tuna. Oh, oh, run, 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 run. Get you, get out of here. Come on, cuh. And she's purring. She likes it. Oh. Peter, she likes getting beat. Whoa, 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 whoa. World star. See, I'm about to go after him. Where are you going? Sorry, I'm just gonna beat tuna up. <laughs> Besides eating Popeyes and staying in line all day over there, I'm gonna be playing the 2v2 Alpha for Modern Warfare with Neslo. I'll probably be uploading some of those videos to my gaming channel. Make sure you guys check that out and go subscribe over there. I think we're, we're closing in on, on 4,000 subs. Uh, but I will also, after I play it here in, in the next couple minutes, uh, I will give my opinion on it and let you guys know briefly in this video, but a more in-depth video will be over on my other channel. Day two. All right, so it is the next day, and like I said last night, I streamed the Modern Warfare Alpha, and then played a little bit of Blackout after that. Where's in the window? He's in the window. Oh, he's in the window. You're getting sniped at two by top, though. Mother, shoot. Duff dirty! Duff dirty! Duff dirty! Oh, Duff please dirty. kill him. Oh, my God. Ah, what the <laughs> Who am I playing, bro? You're playing the worst kids. Just one more top barn. Oh, two, actually. He got revived. Oh, no. No, they're trying to nade Duff Daddy. <laughs> He's getting revived in the garage. Oh, fry him. Oh, my God. Dude, you're kidding me, one dude. <laughs> oh, 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 my God. Where the... <laughs> The accidental movement's fucking crazy. Oh my god, there's one more, he's top barn. 13 bullets. What the fuck am I watching? Oh my god, you're just watching Shane. I literally have my headset on my fucking desk and I just hear Brandon going, Aah! Opinions on the alpha is it's it's a 2v2 alpha, like you can't really get much out of it. People were coming to my stream asking if I thought this game was gonna be good for competitive, I thought it was gonna be good for multiplayer, and like you, you really can't tell because you don't even get to make a class, uh, you don't even get to pick your weapon, you just spawn in with 
whatever gun, it's like gun game, you know, pretty much you, you have to use an assortment of weapons, there's snipers, shotguns, pistols, uh, submachine guns, assault rifles, and, and you don't get to pick, so it's kind of hard to tell. Uh, but based off the, the shooting and stuff, it does seem like the guns do have more recoil. It does seem like aiming and, and shooting and killing people is going to be a lot harder in this game than it is in past Call of Duties. That's just based off a of first opinion of playing the game that obviously could change once the real game comes out. Uh, you, you pretty much just got to wait for when the, the beta releases. Uh, come by my stream and stuff like that and then ask me questions and we'll get to the bottom of it. But Huh? Excuse me? Stone stuff. <laughs> That's pretty much all I got. Dang, he launched that cup. It is free to play if you have PlayStation, so all you gotta do is go to the store and download it. So, I mean, I would recommend at least giving it a chance. It doesn't, all, all you're gonna lose is time if you don't like it. So, that's pretty much all I got to say. Make sure you guys drop a like on the video. Got a whole lot of stuff coming to the Sharp brand. We got some new merch coming. Got a whole new whole new designs, logos, stuff like that. We're doing a full rebrand and uh, I'm I'm actually really excited to to show all that stuff off with the stream overlays and whatnot. Thank you guys for watching and hope hope you guys enjoyed. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Dominic, I know when are you starting your channel? You got so much to say over here. Oh, whoa, whoa there. Uh-huh. He's got it, look. He wants to walk. You're... I put it to level one, which is like the more flexible one. It's oh. a little harder for him. Oh, it's harder for him to push? No, it's easier. Because oh. when it was the, the harder one, the back wheels were like stuff, it'll move, so now like it rolls quicker. Oh. But he's a lot better with it now. I say it looks like he's walking around with a little push mower. Alright, thank you guys for watching. <laughs>